Hello everybody and welcome back to another broadcast here on Spreaker as well as broadcasting to you through wonderful YouTube. And uh, so here we are. First want to give a shout out to all my wonderful listeners out there. Uh, Justice, Jerry, all you guys out there, hopefully all is doing well. It is late, but this is one of my late nights and you know what? Uh, I, I don't know why. But it's it's always been this way. I mean, look at it. It is 1.44 in the morning. And here I am. Still awake. Um, but honestly, I've never had like a, you know, just a straight, normal sleeping schedule. Um, sometimes I will... Selected. Playlist. Button. Oops. Sorry, guys. Sometimes I will go to bed at 10 or 11 o'clock. Sleep till 7 or 8. But if I go to bed late, then I sleep in a little bit later. So, I don't know. It's really never bothered me that bad. Um, obviously, there have been times when I've maybe only slept a few hours. And then, you know, you're dragging the next day. Like, you just feel like you're just dragging all your limbs. But, uh, anyways. So, here I am. Uh, with you guys. But, you know what? I'm glad because I get to do a you know podcast with you guys. And talk to you guys and all that good stuff. Um, and what I, I was trying to find the guy's name. Uh, I'm looking right now just to see if I can find it. But I don't remember his name for me to quote. I'm going to try to look here real quick. Uh, that way I'm not. Let's see here. All right, let's see. Because the one thing it really, uh, that I have noticed, okay, it's not him. I think, I don't think it's this guy. Let me look and see real quick. Anyway, this is what it's about, guys. Everybody making up excuses for Charlie Chill. Oh, he did this. And, oh, it wasn't him. That wasn't him. His account got deleted. Or, you know, all this stuff. Um, and I'm listening to... Someone that had recorded some of his stuff. Um, let's 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 do this. I want you guys to hear this. I'm gonna start this over. Okay. Here. And listen to this. And y'all gonna tell me that someone hacked his account and didn't get deleted for a reason? Bullshit. Yeah, I'm on one, boy. I'm here to tell you right now, bro. I'll pay for your gas. Bring your ass down here, brother. I will pay for your gas. I'll buy you lunch, dude. I'll whip your fucking ass, dude, and I'll buy you a fucking wardrobe. That's what daddy's gonna do for you, man. I'm gonna sign your fucking permission slip to come down here, man. Ain't I? Come on, man. You wanna fight? You wanna talk your shit? Come on, Isaac. Talk your fucking shit now, boy. You see, Charlie don't give a fuck. Charlie will fuck you. Man, fuck this fat fuck. I'm gonna fuck his wife. I mean... Seriously. Seriously. This has got to be the most ridiculous stuff. And this is very... You guys done know. You guys know. Uh, this is nothing compared to what he said in the past. Right? Nothing. But here's what I don't get. You idiots out there that make up excuses for him... And you want to hold his hand. That's what I don't get. And 
I didn't expect the uh, cuss in there, so I apologize for that. Um, hopefully, if I did it right, I was able to uh, beep that part out. But if not, I apologize, okay? Because um, I, I just I can't stand the way he would talk to people and the things that he would say. But what really aggravates the crap out of me is how so many people want to pat him on the back. You want to pat somebody on the back that has made disgusting and very sick threats to people, to innocent children. And I get it. It's, it's you know, it's YouTube, it's media, it's, you know, I get all that. But... I don't get why so many people want to take up for somebody that has the mentality that this guy has. The immaturity. Right? Ridiculous. Um, and I get people saying, well, you know what, be our guest. He kept on firing back at Charlie. He kept on firing back. What do you expect him to do when Charlie's making threats like that to his family? You expect him to sit back and just be like, well, it's not a big deal. You know, I would have had a problem with that. If I was in uh, Isaac's shoes, I would have had a problem with that. You know, and the one thing is this. I try my hardest to judge no one. You know, back before I knew how he was, you know, he gave me a shout out and that meant so much to me. That meant the world to me. And then what, a month later, it all changed, right? Every bit of it just changed. His attitude, uh, true colors about the drugs he was doing, almost burning his thumb off making threats uh, to do really horrible things to Isaac's wife and kids. And then that. And then all of a sudden, his channel is gone. And some are saying, it's not because of what he did. Really? I would hate to see what the heck did get said over on his channel. Honestly. I I never wasted my time to read through this stuff. But just very, very disturbing. And it's ridiculous that some of you out there are idiots to sit there and baby him. I mean, my gosh. You're pretty much supporting someone that has a sick mind that you know, what Michael does and what Angry Grandpa does, uh, they've worked hard at the stuff they've done on YouTube and they deserve happiness. But someone like him, like Charlie, he does not deserve happiness. He needs to go get help. And until that day comes, his life will be nothing but a loop. That's all it'll be, is a loop of nothing but Falling down, falling down, falling down. He might keep on getting, you know, back up on his feet. But he'll continue to fall down. To where he can no longer get back up on his feet. You know, you can only mess up so many times. You can only pass go so many times. And collect $200, right? And, and I think his chances are, are coming to an end. I really do. I don't know. What do you guys think? What is your take? Just in general. Not specifically about Charlie. But just in general. Someone that would do stuff like that over and over. And, and by all means, if you want to give me your opinion about Charlie, go ahead. And I know some of you are going to say, oh... Blah, blah, you know, you're, you're, you're one of Charlie's little, uh, you know, 
baby ears, you know, you got a baby and pat him on the back and you're going to say stuff, but it's not going to matter because everybody knows I share my opinion on my channel. That's what I do. Uh, I had, I had one person say that they didn't like my channel. I was born. That's fine. That's fine. Because the ones that really do respect me, you guys are still here. Uh, and you know what? I can name off people that I know it won't go anywhere. Just because I know how they have respected me from day one. Right? Uh, Justice. Jerry. Blue Wings. Dragon Slayer. A Deadly Gamer. And the list goes on of you guys that, that really do respect me. And that means the world to me. So for you haters and you... Uh, trollers that troll for Charlie, <laughs> you are wasting your time. You are really wasting your time. You will get nowhere being a troll for somebody that that they have no true morals in life to do better. They have no true positivity in their life but to run people down you know uh, anybody that I'll tell you what really where, where the where the respect really really stopped okay where it really stopped to where I it was just you know even down it where I just had two percent left in me for for Charlie uh which when I seen the evidence and the proof of him talking about little kids and talking about doing things to people's wives and definitely about what he said about his father. They took you in and you're going to do that. Uh, Isaac even gave you a chance. And what'd you do? Made them horrible threats that you made. Anyways. I wanted to come on, share my thought about that. Someone said, yeah, tell us. So I'm telling you. That's how I feel about it. Anyone that would support him, well, I don't know. Maybe we should feel sorry for you too. So, anyways, I love every one of you guys, all my supporters out there. Hope everybody has a good week this week. I'll be busy tomorrow and Wednesday. I got to take care of everything Wednesday because my car got impounded. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, well. Things happen and you just got to move on. Right? So. All right. By the way, you can also find... Um, you can also find me on Anchor. It's an app on your iOS. And uh, you can find me on there as well. So, just thought I'd tell you that. Another cool app you are to check out. Do your own little station with music and whatever. It's, it's kind of neat. I w wish it let you record longer, but it doesn't. But I've not seen anywhere where I can make that suggestion. So, anyways, like, share, subscribe, and uh, I will do my best to talk to you guys again tomorrow. We'll do a video, maybe. Uh, see how the weather is tomorrow. And I uh, got to go back. To to class tomorrow, good old English. 13, you gotta love it. 13, so, anyways, 13, you guys take care, like, share, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you soon.